What's going on everybody? It's Loader Drendel here coming at you with a Warframe video. It's Friday, the 5th of October, and Baruch Katir has arrived. For those of you on PS4, he is on the Cronia Relay on Saturn. So why don't we take a nice little trip? Oh, the UI's changed a little bit since this with this the, Okay, yeah, sorry about that. But yeah, I actually forgot that the updates jumped in yesterday and I wasn't on, so I had to wait a bit to do this video. But why don't we take a gander, see what Barakatir has. Alright. And of course we do the old roll and jumping. And there he is. I didn't even bother to wait for him to talk. All right, so. Mm-hmm. Okay then. Uh, what we got? Prisma. Tw oh, okay, nice. The Prisma Twin Gremlins. Uh, it, it popped up in this popped up in the codex about maybe three weeks ago. Maybe actually maybe about two, and I never, and I and I thought I admit when I had gone on my vacation I missed it. Well, apparently not. Uh, rifle ammo and shotgun ammo mutations. We got pistol mutation, primed regen, Mara Detron, a Excalibur Odonata Noggle, Odonata Elixir skin, the Katir Foros set, if you will. We've got. Kavat Sentinel Mask Wings and Tail. We've got a Katir Sugatra Dragon Mod Pack, uh, Dark Sword Day of the Dead, Weezar Day of the Dead Kavat Armor, Sands of an Honest Blueprint. All right, so <sighs> let's look over the weapons real quick. Just and pause the video for you guys to look it over as necessary. Then the Prisma. Whew. Wow, that's a, <laughs> quite a master rank requirement. So what do I recommend here? Well, this one's kind of a toss up. It's not a good line a good good lineup. I mean I like this. So let's start with fashion framers, as I always do. Would it, whichever pieces you haven't gotten, I would say go ahead and grab them. If you're aiming to grab the complete Katir, Foros, plates, chest, and leg plates all together, it's good. You're gonna be, it'll cost you 710 ducats. The Raza Siandana at 400. The full Kavat Sentinel set 1300. Sugatra 250. The Day of the Dead skins total would be 720. After, after you've done all that, then you got the Odonata skin for 350, 90 for the Noggle statue. Dang, that's a, quite a bit if you ask me. So after that, I get you know you go for your I'd say yeah go for the Mar Detron Prisma Twin Gremlins, and then the Prime Regen. I actually don't mind this one so, when I, since I use this in combination with Sacrifice from time to time. So for those of you who are not fashion framers. What do I recommend? Whew. So I would say go first go for the weaponry. So I would start if you if you've already got Mara Detron that you know don't worry about it. Go for the Prisma Twin Gremlins. Let's see. Combined it'll cost you'll be it'll cost you a thousand ducats for both. After that, go for the Prime Regen for the, your Sentinel. Like I said, again if you have sacrifice, great in tandem. After that, there's really not the other three are not that great. I would say go for it only, only if you have you know if you want to collect and you have spare ducats. After that, you know you can kind of go all, go all out on the fashion frame stuff if you want. What do I not recommend? The dragon mod pack because as you see, you roll the dice to get two guaranteed rare out of a pack of five mods when you could easily trade with people just to get them then we get you know Sands of Anaros blueprint this will be if you have not done the Anaros quest line so 
No, no, there is. Barrow, I'll be back later. So that's what I have to say about the Barrow Kateer for today, for this weekend. He's here till Sunday. If you guys found this to be useful, be sure to hit the like button and, well, hello. Feel free to comment and subscribe. Tell me what you guys think of Barrow's lineup. And as always, thanks for watching.